Hi, this is Harish Bali from technofair.com. Google Drive is a reliable cloud storage platform to save your important files and folders. Apart from this, Google Drive is a good alternate for free web hosting. You can host your basic website and publish any kind of static content. Some of the advantages of hosting website on Google Drive are A. You get up to 15 GB of free space. B. You can publish pictures and videos on the sites that's hosted on Google Drive. C. The process is really simple and easy to follow. To learn more, watch this video. Log in to Google Drive using your Gmail account, username and password. And once you are on your drive, first thing that you need to do is to create a new folder for which click on new, go to folder and name this folder. I am naming it as my new website, create. Select the folder that you have just created and click on share my new website. Advanced. Any new folder that you create on Google Drive is set to private setting. Since this is a website, so I am going to change the settings from private to public. Click on change and choose the first option on public on the web. Anyone on the internet can find and access this. No sign in required. Save and you are done. Now the next thing you need to do is to copy all the website content that you have including HTML pages, JavaScript, audio and video files to this new folder. Open the folder. I've got all the website content here. Select all the files and simply drag all the file content to Google Drive. This uploading can take some time depending upon size of your website content. Once uploading is complete, go to my drive, open the website folder. You need to copy the folder ID, the ID that starts after drive slash folders. Simply select it and press Ctrl plus C from your keyboard. Open new tab and type Google Drive dot com slash host slash paste the folder ID by pressing Ctrl plus V from your keyboard and press enter. You will see a shift here. It has now moved to HTTPS and this is your website. Your website is now live on Google Drive. This is the website URL which is too long for anyone to remember. So there are two options here. Either you go for a free domain or you go for a paid domain. I'll explain you how to go around using both the options. Let's first explore the free domain option. Open the new tab and there are many websites that provide free domain and one such site is dot dot tk. You can try the domain of your choice but the extension will be dot tk. So you don't have a choice choice here because it's a free domain site. So let me try for stone age dot tk go. So this says that the domain is available. So what I need to do is simply copy the URL and paste it here. Choose the number of months for which you need it. Enter CAPTCHA. You need to sign up before starting this, but I'm just trying to do it using without sign up. You can share this new registered domain on Facebook, Twitter or LinkedIn. And after 10 or 15 minutes, you can check your new domain by simply opening a tab and type your website URL stoneage.tk. And this is the website with a customized domain with a TK extensions. If you want your website name to have an extension of .com, .org or something else, then you need to buy it from a domain service provider. So I've bought my domains from GoDaddy. This is my GoDaddy account login page. Go to domains. So this method may differ from service provider to service provider. Let's say I want to host this website on smoleaders.com. I'll go to manage. I will need to click on this manage forwarding. 
add forwarding forward it to go to the website url and copy this url go back and paste it here since this is a temporary forward so i'm clicking on temporary forward only add save at this stage you need to speak to your domain service provider tell them that you are trying to host a website on google drive using a customized domain they will share a pointing ip with you which you need to go and put under dns zone file propagation can take about 48 hours and after 48 hours your customized domain with the .com .org extension will start working there are some limitations of hosting website on google drive first there is no way to add a HTML page directly on Google Drive. So if you want to add a page, you will have to do that offline. Second, there is no customer service support number to speak to over the phone if you have any problem with regard to hosting. Well, despite that, it's a good choice on free web hosting. If you want to learn more about Google Drive, click on the links appearing in front of your screen. Also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel by clicking on the subscribe button. And thanks for watching.